Okay, for this example, I'm doing implicit differentiation. Um, let's start by clearing the denominator. So I'll move that one plus cos y to the right-hand side. So I get two plus three x in brackets, one plus cos y. Okay, I would not expand. I would just uh, do the derivative first. So I prime both sides. And what do I get? On the left-hand side, I get uh, minus 3 sine x is equal to product rule. So f prime is 3 times g plus f g prime uh, minus sine y and then a y prime popping out for my chain rule. Okay, so I have just the one y prime term, so I'll leave it where it is. Minus three sine x minus three one plus cos y is equal to Come on. And then solving for y prime, I get minus three sine x minus three. Mm, minus 3 cos y all divided by 2 plus 3x minus sine y is y prime. So at this point I'll sneak a peek. This is uh, coming from uh, a worksheet I have in front of me. So I'll sneak a peek at the answer and see how I'm doing. And how am I doing? Uh, let me see. I'm doing pretty good. So I'll just um, see a whole bunch of negatives going on. So the answer I'm looking at doesn't have so many negatives on top. So if I want to take my answer and make it look like the answer I'm going for, I'll multiply top and bottom by minus one. And that'll give me three sine x plus three plus three cos y on top all over two sine y plus three x sine y is y prime. And that is the answer I'm looking for. I'll zoom out, you can see the whole thing. And I'll see you in the next video.